I remember, Mark, I saw you on stage for the first time and you were wowie zowie and you were like this guy that was so up and you were so engaging and you made me pay attention and you made me listen and I thought there's no way that guy is like that all the time. I saw him at the grocery store at Martin's after church on a Saturday night. Leave it to Mark to, you know, grab a cart and be like, oh goodness, this is, isn't this great? And oh, we're gonna go grocery shopping. That's just who he is, even in the mundane tasks of grabbing a grocery cart. Every time I'd see Mark going through the halls, he would say something like, I'm super glad you're here. And I'd be like, thanks, how are you? He's like, I'm doing great, you're here. When I was 11 years old, I remember seeing a video during the service of him playing drums and doing a drum solo. That was kind of what sparked my first interest in drums. And I thought, if Mark Beeson could do it, I could probably do it. I was in sort of a moment of crisis. And you said to me, listen, it's all about lifting up, looking up, bringing people up. And that's what you did for me in that moment. Uh, it's, it's so like you to know what we need to hear, whether it's three simple words like, uh, you've got this, or 3,000 words on a weekend uh, message. A friend invited me to come. Walked into this auditorium. I was thinking, oh my goodness, what's going on here? And then you came out and you preached that night. I felt like you were just talking to me and said that God loves me and that he forgives me. And after hearing Mark Beeson speak for the first time, I finally felt like I was home. I'm not afraid of church anymore. And I can't imagine my life without this church in it. It's been a place where I've been able to find some hope. And without you creating that, I don't know where I'd be. You guys changed my life. And you have helped me take my next step towards Christ. You have taught us that God can move mountains and heal. I was at the hospital in Chicago, and Mark heard about me being in the hospital, and he came all the way there. And I remember being in my hospital bed and looking at my door to my room, and there was Mark. He prayed with my husband and I, and I'll never forget that. You took your time to meet with me one-on-one -on -one when I needed encouragement and I still have notes from my last little meeting, so thank you for that again. I don't know where I would be in my life without you. Going to Camp Adventure for the first time, when you spoke, uh, it was like something came alive in me. Jesus wasn't just this thing, but I could actually have a relationship with him, and that changed my life forever. I just remember your smile, because that impacted my life. You have planted a seed in my heart and planted a seed in all of our children's lives. So Mark, thank you for being genuine. Thank you for bringing us closer to Christ. Thank you for making GCC a safe place. For me to feel welcome, no matter what I've done. Thank you for being a pioneer in the church. Thank you for all that you've done for the community. Thank you so much for all you've done in this church. For all that you've done for us. Thank you, Mark. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Pastor Beeson. Thanks, Mark. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you.